Japan. You guys are ready to lose in your own playlist? <laughs> Bite me, Hello Kitty. Can you believe these jackasses? They kind of remind me of someone. Anyway, guys, I advise you get in the zone stat. The path is gonna get real technical real fast, and you're not facing Abarths anymore. Copy that, knuckle down. You all good, friend? We got you yet another car from the JDM Golden Era. The most forward-thinking car in the world back then. The Mitsubishi 3000 GT, or simply GTO in Japan. Shingo, you're gonna tell us more? Yeah, you got it. Wait, um, two turbochargers, four-wheel steering, and an electronic exhaust control system. Not bad. You've only missed the active aero control system. Oh yeah, motorized aerodynamics that adapts to your speed. That car was a freaking Japanese Batmobile. Way ahead of its time. I think we gotta switch from a Hashiria to a Bosuzoku state of mind. Okay, meaning? We go rough, brother. exactly a piece of cake yeah but that's what makes it interesting right plus it's nothing for a driving whiz like you nothing at all Forest, the finish line will only be a few seconds away. If you guys want to try something, it's now. Change our radio frequency. I know, 
I'm sorry about the intrusion. Heard you people defeated all your opponents so far. That's quite a tally. Anyways, we're all stoked to be facing you. May the best team win. Over and out. How about that? Watch out, guys. I foresee a very mean curve at the end of the straightaway. deadly. Yeah, I expect lots of razor-sharp turns peppered with short straights on these mountain roads. Not to mention the 200-foot drop if you miss any of them. Just the way we like it. Manners and mean cars. Looks like our opponents are the real deal. But it's quite bold of them to think they could beat Japanese racers in a toge. Well, cats are known for being cocky. Remember our last toge driver? It was you against me then. Don't you forget, it's all about drifting. Oversteer while maintaining control for a high exit speed. told you that the Skyline GTRs were called Godzilla. Well, that R32 you're driving was the first one to earn that name. This is the original monster, and its victory streaks are beyond compare. I'm gonna make it simple. For years, that car was unstoppable on the Japanese car racing scene. The R32 changed the rules and left everyone in the dust for years. It was created to beat the shit out of everyone, and it did. Closing in, guys. Focus till the end. No matter what, this race belongs to one of our two skylines. You become the king of the mountains, my friend. Incredible race, spectacular driver. Invincible car. team is playing their trump card. Good kitties. Check out these cars, man. They're clearly bigger cats. Doesn't matter, does it? These guys are still cats. We are dragons. street racing teams. Only one member of each group gets to race, and you're the one racing for the pack. Ugh, lucky. Officially passing the torch, big brother? Just this one time. Oh my god, goosebumps, literally. You can 
drive Wengen style on that speedway, which means really fast. Just watch out in these tunnels. Driver, we spoke about it in the Liberty Walk playlist. This is the Liberty Walk version of the 92 Honda NSX. Oh man. Yeah, that's Shingo's dream car. Basically the same NSX as he always drives, except for this one's been in the hands of the master Wataru Kato, which brings it to a whole new level. I want to drive that car. Yeah, you and me both, brother. For the firepower contest that is the final race, this special NSX will do nicely. race my friend and it'll be an overwhelming victory for the pack that's what we're shooting for right always looks like you guys are for real after all you won this made in japan thing now come and get us out there see what happens just opened up. <laughs> 